Welcome to Giving Breaths in Infant CPR. In this video, we'll discuss the steps of how to give breaths to infants. Like children, many cases of cardiac arrest in infants are primarily due to respiratory problems. Giving breaths and administering chest compressions are important for infants receiving CPR. A good breath will cause the chest to rise. To give breaths, first open the infant's airway by putting one hand on their forehead and placing your fingers on the bony part of the chin. Then, gently tilt their head back while lifting the chin. Be careful not to tilt the head too far back as this can block the airway. Be sure to press on the bony part of the chin and not the soft part under the chin as pressing the soft part may also block the airway. To give a breath, hold the airway open as described above by gently pressing the forehead back and lifting the chin with your fingers. Take a deep breath and seal your mouth around the infant's mouth and nose. Blow for one second and watch the chest rise. Very little volume or force is required to inflate an infant's lungs. Blowing too much or too hard will damage the infant's lungs. Only a gentle exhale for a tiny puff of air is required for an infant. Repeat for a second breath. If unable to cover both mouth and nose entirely with your mouth, use the following method for rescue breathing. Open the airway using the head tilt chin lift maneuver. Two, pinch the infant's nose close. Create a seal using your lips to surround the infant's mouth. If the chest does not rise after the first breath, let the head go back to a normal position and then reopen the airway by tilting the head and lifting the chin. Try to get a breath in while watching for the chest rise. Do not interrupt compressions for any more than 10 seconds while giving breaths. This concludes our lesson on giving breaths in CPR. Next, we'll review mask use in infants.